Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to fix the update error code 0x80073701 on Windows 10 in no time. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to run the Windows Update Troubleshooter. Now to do this press the start button in the lower left corner and then select the gear icon which is the settings option. Now in here just scroll down until you find the update and security category and click on it and now in the next window select the troubleshoot option on the left pane and then on the right side locate additional troubleshooters and click on it. And now the last thing you have to do in here is select the windows update option in the troubleshooter and then click on the run the troubleshooter option. Now wait until windows will detect any issues and fix them as soon as possible and then you can just restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to run DISM and SFC scans. Now to do this press the windows button then type in cmd and then run command prompt as an administrator. And in here in the command prompt window make sure to copy paste the following commands but make sure to press enter after each command. Now after the commands are processed wait a bit until they will finish and then restart your computer and check if the issue still persists. Moving on, another great solution is to restart the Windows Update service. Now to do this, press the Windows button, then type in services and select it as an application from the search result. As you can see, the services list is quite big, so if you want to find a specific service, make sure to click on a random one, then type the first letter corresponding to the service you're looking for. In our case, it's W. So scroll down from here on until you find the Windows Update service, double click on it, and then if the service status in the next window is set to running, make sure to click on the stop button to stop the service. Now wait a bit until it's stopped, then once again click on the start button to restart the service, and additionally if you want to, you can also set the startup type to automatic. Now click on apply and ok to save the changes, restart your PC and check if the issue still persists. However, as an alternative we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it. Super simple, isn't it? Of course, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and as usual, subscribe to our channel. Thank you.